let me take you on a journey to Texas, where the vibrant and colorful red tanagers reside in the vast wilderness. These strikingly beautiful birds with their fiery red feathers and jet black wings, they're a treat for the eyes of any nature lover. As per recent statistics, there are 21 species of tanagers found in Texas alone, and the red tanager is among the most commonly spotted species. These birds are usually found in dense forests, where they thrive on a diet of insects, fruits, and seeds. The tanager is easily distinguishable by its bright red feathers, which are more intense in males than females. Males also have black wings and tail feathers, while females have olive green wings and tail feathers. These birds are small, measuring only about seven inches in length, but they make up for it with their bold and flashy appearance. One of the fascinating aspects of the red tanager is its distinctive song. These birds are known for their sweet, high-pitched chirping, which can be heard from far away. Their melodious tunes add to the already serene and calming environment of the forest. However, despite their striking beauty, these birds are facing threats due to habitat loss and degradation. The red tanager is a magnificent bird. It symbolizes the beauty of nature. Believe it or not, it's a member of the cardinal family. That family also includes grosbeaks and buntings. The cardinal family is a group of North and South American songbirds named after their most famous member, the Northern Cardinal. Tanagers are only found in the Americas. Carl Linnaeus, a Swedish naturalist, described the red tanager in his book Systema Natura in 1758. He was the father of modern taxonomy. He was also a Swedish botanist, zoologist, and physician. Linnaeus introduced the concept of binomial nomenclature in his 1758 book, Systema Nature, a scientific naming system that uses two Latin words to name each species, one for the genus and the other for the species. Linnaeus described several species in his book, including the red tanager, which he named Paranga rubra. The genus Paranga is named after the Tupi word Paranga, which means red bird, and rubra, which means red in Latin. Linnaeus's Systema Natura was a seminal work that established and standardized naming systems for plants and animals, allowing scientists to communicate and study the natural world more effectively. Linnaeus's system of binomial nomenclature is still used by scientists worldwide all the way till today, making his contributions to taxonomy invaluable. So the next time you find yourself in the vast wilderness of Texas, keep an eye out for these vibrant and striking birds. You never know when one might fly right up next to you. These are Interesting Things with J.C.